friend. I'm so excited you've called. I hope you're doing well. Did you hear the vlogmas? I have literally been feeling so tired and lethargic the last two days. This morning, I snoozed my alarm till eight, but I'm gonna try to bring my day around, try to lift my spirits. I decided I'm gonna pick up some Starbucks because Starbucks just makes me happy. It's not the source of my happiness, but it definitely lifts my moods. And you can already tell, I'm here at the Starbucks line and my mood's already like, woo. I'm gonna get my usual that I always get, java chip. I feel like it's always a gamble if it's gonna taste good or not. Sometimes they make it taste like too much milk. Sometimes it tastes like the perfect amount of coffee. Good morning, what can I get for you? Good morning, can I get a tall java chip? Yeah, anything else? Uh, can I get that with extra ice and no whipped cream, please? Extra ice, no whipped Chip? Yes. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good day. You too. You know, something I really missed about working out at home in my room was being able to set the mood with my LED lights and then also playing loud music versus having to wear my AirPods because it can be kind of annoying to work out with AirPods. They're always falling out of my ears. I'm also not worried about someone walking into the gym and seeing me doing a weird move or something. So I'm just currently taking my pre-workout and having my little pre-workout snack so I can have a little bit more energy while I work out because as I'm telling you guys, I literally feel so lazy. I feel like I need a little bit of a boost to just power me through the workout. We're gonna do some shopping here in the downtown area. I did actually see on Instagram that one of the local coffee shops here is having like cute nightmare before christmas themed coffee cups i mean not coffee cups sorry i can't think coffee and i want to get one it's called oogie boogie based off of the nightmare before christmas did you know that last month they had twilight themed one of the drinks was called where the hell have you been mocha we so should have came but we're gonna go ahead and take advantage of the nightmare before christmas one so let's go and get my coffee real quick We have secured the drink. I thought it was gonna be a little bit more colorful, but to be honest, I really don't know what to expect in coffees because I never really drink coffees. I was kinda expecting that. What, this? Just like one color. Okay, so this drink here is the Nightmare Before Christmas themed and it's based off of Oogie Boogie. It has vanilla, toasted marshmallow, and peppermint chai. It actually sounds really good, so fingers crossed it tastes good. We're not really big coffee drinkers or I don't even, I don't, I don't even think, can I speak? Um, <laughs> I don't think I've ever tried chai. Mmm, that's good, it kind of tastes like um, horchata. Yeah, with peppermint. Yeah, it's actually really good. I like it. You don't like it? Yeah, it's good. Not enough to... Not enough to sit there and drink the whole thing. Mmm, I like it. It's delicious. It's delicious. So it's, mm. Boy, if you don't... Okay, so next we are going to be going to the local thrift store that we always go to. And I'm very sad because they're actually going to be closing next month. So I did see that they put something up on their Instagram. And I was like, can you please save this for me because I want it. Let's head over to the thrift store. thing that I came for plus I got a jean jacket I've been looking for one that fits me loose and not tight but not like huge oh now my hair being crazy okay so we're gonna do a quick haul of what we got I got two items Brenda got one item so no 
sweater this. holds it. Okay, so can I borrow this actually? What? Your sweater. When I showed it to you, you made me feel like it was ugly. All I said was, oh, it's, it's, it's cute. I asked you if you were jealous okay. of me and you said no. Well, yeah, why would I be jealous? Because you should be. This is the jean jacket I got. It's so cool. I've never heard of this brand. It's John Blaze. Johnny Blaze. Old Santa jacket moment. Can I borrow this too? <laughs> oh, so you guys see, it's not just me borrowing her clothes. And then this is the sweater that I came for. I saw it on Instagram and I know that some people probably think that this is ugly, but I have a fascination for ugly clothes that look like that your grandma cute. would wear it or your grandpa would wear it. You know what I mean? That is cute. The other thing that we got. Wait. <laughs> Don't you just love how you said um, <laughs> yeah. yeah, but because I paid for it, I have like sole proprietorship over it. Okay, so if <laughs> I bought it, I have proprietorship, whatever. <laughs> You better not leave that in. Amen. <laughs> You're rude. I need some hot Cheetos to go with this. Mmm. Mmm, delicioso. It tastes like grandma's house. Grandma's house. This little uh, pullover sweater that says Oregon Coast. It's like the blue one you stole from me. Kind of, yeah. That's our quick haul. Next, we're gonna go to, you know where I always wanted to go? Where? I always wanted to go to the little stores right there, but they're always closed. Right down to go. I think they're open right now. I think they close at five. It's spring clean. So we are headed to some other little local shops. I ended up finding these little soaps that smell delicious. So first one is vanilla and oat. Oh my god, that smells so good. And then the other one is just pure vanilla whisper. Oh my god, this one smells amazing. And then I got Brenda this little butterscotch lip balm. So I got my Black Friday order from Sephora and it's really just to restock on all of my skincare products. But I thought I would do a little haul and show you guys what I got. First thing that I got is a restock on my cleanser. The Murad Acne Control Clarifying Cleanser for normal to oily skin. I think it's normally like $34, but for the Black Friday sale, I got this for $16. This is the Ordinary Niacinamide Serum. All-time favorite, I swear by this. This is by far my favorite skincare brand because literally I've bought so many things from here. This is the Hyaluronic Acid Serum. I also picked up their Vitamin C, which is another go-to. These are constant restock items as well. Like, I've been using these for over a year now. Paula's Choice 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliants. I feel like this has really cleared up my skin. It is next level. Unbeatable. And then the last thing I got was the little birthday gift. I actually already have this lipstick, and I really like it. They didn't have any other things that I really wanted. This is so cute because it's tiny and I can put this in my purse. It's beautiful. I love these. I literally have the full size version. I think it's right here. Full size version, birthday present version. Ah, oh, so cute, look at it. And then it also does come with, oh, this is so cute. Look at this. This is the little NARS compact. I think it's a highlighter in Laguna. It's like a nice little sheen, very, very subtle. I don't know if you can even, oh, you can see like the glitter. These are so cute. I love little like trial size things because they literally last so long. You don't even need to buy the full version sometimes. I'm 
I am literally having the most lethargic experience of my life right now. I literally don't want to do anything. I just want to lay here. This whole day, the day has just been so slow. I don't know what's going on with me. I'm just like... Ugh. Sometimes it sucks to be a woman. I'm just going to take a nap here. Mm -hmm.